So the first week of Black Ops 4 has officially ended and it's been a crazy week for the community guys. We have figured out a bunch of stuff regarding multiplayer, blackouts, and especially zombies. It's been a crazy week for zombies guys. But one of the things we figured out for multiplayer specifically was the signature weapons and how to get them and basically what happens when you do get them. So in this video guys, I'm going to be breaking down the MX-9 Patriot variant on its reactive and Mastercraft sets on how to get them and the easiest way to get them it's because the reactive set is the one with flames on it and the Mastercraft set is the one with the skull on the side. You'll see what I mean while we get into the video. But my name is Nick and without further ado, let me help you guys out on figuring out what the Patriot is and basically what these signature weapons are and how to get them. First off, let me showcase the Patriots. This is the Patriot variant for the MX-9, and I love the look of the Patriot. I can't wait for future variants in Black Ops 4. Now, the only way to get the MX-9 Patriot is by buying the deluxe editions of Black Ops 4, meaning editions that aren't the standard, and the standard is 60 bucks, meaning you're going to have to be spending some big bucks to get this variant, basically. But here is the Patriot next to the standard MX-9, and as you can tell, they're sort of difference they're not that big in difference but they're sort of difference and i really like how the iron sights look this is what the iron sights look like compared to each other and i really do like both of their iron sights but honestly they're just they're both amazing one of them is not better than the other they're both amazing and once you do get this variant you have two challenges you can go for or basically two camo sets that's what i call these because they're technically camos but they're not really they're basically sets to make the variant look a little bit better and more flashy also for everyone wondering how can you see the patriot basically just go to your creative class go to the mx9 and you'll see a tiny arrow just click up on the d-pad or up on the stick and you should be able to see the patriots and then you can select it and yeah the first one is take it personally and that is the reactive set and basically to get this set you have to earn one of each metal type in a single game if you don't know what that means that basically means you have to earn one medal of every single medal in the game and that means one medal of the combat one medal in the specialist one medal in anti-specialist one medal in score streaks one medal in anti-score streaks and one medal in game modes in a single game and the best game mode to actually get these is or to get the reactive set if you do have the patriots is control control is the best way to get it because a for the combat area the easiest one you can do is get a revenge kill or get a headshot that's the easiest thing you can actually do that i found pretty easy in the combat tab now for the specialist tab you just got to get two or more kills with specialist things like the purifier for the fire break or basically once you have some extra health from crash or anything like that just two or more kills from any of the specialists and boom you have the specialist tab done for anti-specialist you just got to kill somebody that basically has some health from crash on the enemy team or kill somebody who's basically using the fire break or just anything like that and boom you have the anti-specialist done now for score streaks you just got to call in a score streak a attack helicopter or a hellstorm or anything and just kill one person and boom you have score streaks done for anti-score streaks, you just gotta basically wait for somebody to call in a UAV or anything like that and destroy it and boom, you're done with anti-score streaks. And for game mode, all you gotta really do is kill somebody on an objective, win a game, or basically win a match, or basically just capture a point and boom, you're done. That is really how you get the reactive camo. It's not hard. A lot of people have explained this pretty weirdly i don't know but the best way i can tell you guys right now is play control you can literally get all of that once you play control control is the best game mode to get every or one medal from every single category done and getting the reactive camo now i'm 100 sure you got to have the patriot on but i'm not sure if you had to have the reactive camo set like clicked on because it looks really weird but just for safekeeping click on the reactive camo and now the next is soldier of fortune this is the mastercraft set and it's pretty simple the only way to get the mastercraft set is get 50 kills after you get the reactive set and it's not 50 kills in one game it's just 50 kills overall with the patriots and then boom you have the complete sets of the patriot variant both its reactive sets and its mastercraft sets now both the reactive sets and the mastercraft set do have camo tiers and if you don't know what camo tiers is basically something new in black ops 4 basically making the camos change 
in their look based off your actions in game. And that's the breakdown of the Patriot variants in Call of Duty Black Ops 4, guys. I try to break it down as simple as possible because some of the videos I've seen, they're pretty, like, weird. Again, they're really weird and I can't understand it so well so this is my way of telling you guys how to get the reactive and the easiest way to get it and also how to get mastercraft and what these variants are and basically what can they do and what these reactive and mastercraft sets can do they're really just camo sets to basically make the variant pop up a little or pop out a little more but i hope to see more in the future and i hope you guys like this video and i hope it did help you guys for anybody who has the patriot variant now if you guys did like this and it did help you drop likes helps me out a ton and if you're new to channel subscribe for more see content because i upload every monday wednesday and friday and remember that bell and subscribe button so you don't miss an upload and also follow me on twitch.tv slash 45 because i will be streaming some blackout every once in a while with my friends so if you're interested with that then i highly recommend following me on twitch.tv slash 45 but guys that is basically pretty much it for this video and i'll see you in my next one so peace